Okay, so today I had someone ask for me to do a tutorial on how to play Goodbye World Goodbye. So this is what I do. I did another video about transposing. So I have put this song in the key of A flat because it's the, the key that I can sing it the best in. So as you can see, I've got my chords written. So every time it changes chords, you can see that I have those written in. And I'm just going to show you, all I'm going to do is simple chording for A flat, then I will change to D flat seventh, A flat. So you can see what I'm doing. I'm going to do a few lines and then we'll stop. And I've got my son helping me with recording. So he's going to show you my hands and we're going to do, I'm just going to show you how to do the A flat and the D flat seventh and then the A flat on those first couple of lines and then we'll regroup. So showing my hands here. So I'm going to put them on the A flat chord. So my right hand is playing in just an A flat chord and you can, you know, you can do the basic one. You can invert it any way you want. These are all the same notes. It doesn't matter how you do it. Um, this is just easier right now. So my right hand is on the A chord. And so my left hand, I'm going to put on, they're both going to be hitting the A flat note. And then as I'm chording, I will hit the E flat in between. So for example, I'll do this. So it's very simple. So you pretty much can do that for every chord. And so if I'm going to do the D flat, then I would come down here on D flat and hit the D flat chord. So simple. So when we start the song, this is all you have to do. I've told all my troubles goodbye. Goodbye to each tear and each sigh. So that's pretty much your basic chording. So every time the notes change, then I just change the chord. So you just kind of get into a rhythm. And I know a lot of people like to know the little extra things that you throw in that make a song sound really neat. So after those first two lines, it goes into this world where I roam cannot be my home. So all I do to go into this world where I roam is C, D flat, D. So let me show you that. Goodbye to each tear and each sigh. See what I did? And then I'll just go walk right up to this world where I roam. Goodbye to each tear and each sigh. This world where so while I'm doing that, when I get to the E flat, then I'm just hitting my basic E flat chord. My right hand is on the E flat chord and my left hand is hitting E flat up and down. And, and then I'm just doing my middle finger is on, or my pointer finger is on that middle note. And so every time you're doing a new chord, that's all you do. So if you start the song over, I've told all my troubles goodbye, goodbye to each tear. Anytime you have an E flat seventh, that's what I'm hitting here. You're still doing the same thing with your left hand, but my right hand, instead of just hitting the E flat chord, I throw in that seventh. And the seventh just means when you do the full chord, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, you're hitting that with it. And it just kind of gives it a little extra sound. So anytime you see a seventh thrown in, then you can, that's what you do. So like I said, it's pretty basic. A flat, D flat, A flat, E flat and you just keep that pattern going. So once you figure out what all of your chords are, let's show them this again. So once you figure out um, what all of your chords are, then you can just keep doing that pattern. So you can see down here on the chorus, it goes into C seventh, D flat seventh, F seventh. And like I said, you just have to get yourself into that pattern and it'll take some practice if it's not something that you're used to. But that's pretty much the basics for playing Goodbye World Goodbye in the key of A flat. Thanks for watching.